The Northrop F-5 is actually a family of supersonic light fighter aircraft. There are two main models, the F-5A and the F-5 Freedom Fighter variants, and the F-5E and F-5F Tiger II variants. The later variants are extensively updated. The design of the F-5 was initiated by Northrop. The goal was to reverse the trend in fighter development, which at the time gravitated towards greater size and weight. The intention was to deliver a high-performance fighter that was very maneuverable and reliable, at a low cost. The fighter was also supposed to be designed with a growth potential. The goal was a long service life. The development was started in the mid-1950s, as the U.S. Navy needed a smaller fighter. The intention was to operate the fighter from the Navy's smaller escort carriers. As the U.S. Navy withdrew the escort carriers, Northrop continued to develop the aircraft. A two-seat advanced trainer, designated N-156T, and a single-seat fighter, designated N-156F, were developed. In 1956, the U.S. Air Force selected the N-156T as a replacement for the T-33. It was renamed the YT-38 Talon. The Talon made its first flight in June 1959, and was produced until January 1972. A total of 1,158 Talons were produced. Northrop continued to develop the N-156F fighter as a private venture. The first prototype flew in July 1959, exceeding the speed of sound on its first flight. For some time it looked like the fighter was a failure, but in 1962 the Kennedy administration revived the project. The N-156F was redesignated the F-5A and went into production in October 1962. 624 F-5As were produced until 1972, as well as 200 F-5B two-seater trainers, and 86 RF-5A reconnaissance aircraft. In 1970, Northrop won a competition to replace the F-5A. Better air-to-air -air performance was needed. The F-5A-21, later renamed the F-5E, was the result. It was equipped with more powerful engines. It also had a longer and larger fuselage, as well as modified wings that made the plane more maneuverable. The avionics were improved, and a radar was added. Previous versions of the F-5 did not have a radar. The first F-5E flew on August 11, 1972. A two-seat trainer version was also introduced, the F-5F. It was slightly longer, and combat-capable. A reconnaissance version, the RF-5E Tiger Eye, with a sensor package in the nose, was also offered. The F-5E eventually received the official name Tiger II. Northrop made the F-5 with an export market in mind. The U.S. Air Force started operating the F-5A to train pilots and crew for customer nations. However, after combat evaluation, a slightly modified version, designated the F-5C, entered combat in Vietnam. The F-5C flew over 2,600 sorties over Vietnam and Laos, and proved capable. But the F-5C's service in Vietnam was considered a political gesture, to help export sales of the aircraft. The F-5 has also served in an aggressor training role in the U.S., due to its performance similarity to the MiG-21. In 2020, it was still in service in the U.S. Navy. The aircraft type was exported to many nations, including Norway, Brazil, Iran, Saudi Arabia, Malaysia and the Netherlands. Some other countries it served in are Switzerland, the Philippines, Vietnam, Mexico, Morocco, and Venezuela.